You want to try and hit right in the center of that target every time you shoot it. And sometimes when you get a little off, what you have to do is you have to really think center and hit your target as opposed to just shooting at a big circle up there. A lot of guys do that, but that's really not the deal. You've got to find a target and you've got to shoot for the target. So make sure as you're warming up, and this is what she's doing right now, she's warming up to do what we call mixed college and high school training against four division one players. And there's six high school girls that are working out with them and they're doing combination training where they'll do drills against each other and they'll also compete one-on-one, -on -one, two on two, three on three, and then we'll go a full court five on five. And we do that before we do our regular training. And anytime you're doing, what we're doing right now is we're doing spot shooting. We wanted to get this spot down here because that's where your point guards, they're gonna get it a lot right there. What other things do you normally do when you come out here, Sydney? Um, lots of ball handling, lots of shooting, holding my follow through, working on the right form, the right rhythm, and knocking down the shot. If you could think of one tip that might really help a young player, maybe in the seventh or eighth grade, what would that tip be? You know, something maybe that you do that you picked up from somebody. What? It would definitely be changing speed, changing direction. If there's a point guard, that's the most important thing. Especially when you get to high school, you go to college, next level. Changing speed and changing direction is the main part of the game. So. The next part of what we're going to do now is work on a shot fake, one bounce, and then get a jump shot right in this area here somewhere, okay? And we'll do some warm-ups. We'll do some warm-ups here before we're actually going to go out and play. You guys that are working these kids out, you know, positive affirmation goes a, whole, a long way. And then getting to the correction point, most players can correct themselves but sometimes they get in a funk and they just need to look at themselves on film and that's what we're doing now we're filming and she's going to get to look at herself as she shoots and she releases i'd like it a little bit quicker release okay i'm just watching a player like her maybe on youtube and then relating it to yourself filming yourself and seeing if you parallel with her perfect that's it that was perfect release Great. All right, that's good. Now, now what we want to do is we want to come in. We want to come in off the dribble and do step backs right here. Okay. All right. You've got to work on them in your warm up so that you're, when you're called upon to shoot that, the situation says you got to go shoot it. You got to have that in your bag, and it's also got to be warmed up prior to you play it. Great footwork. That's good. You're hearing it from Arizona State's Sydney Goodson.